Without the bridge, I probably would not be the same person sitting in front of this camera right now. There's a lot of stress that is put on kids and homework. Some people, they might think it's like hard to fit in, but this is a place where everyone can fit in. Just providing a safe, fun place for teens, and we need that. My favorite thing about the bridge as a student was just how warm, welcoming, and inviting everybody was. The bridge is welcoming to so many different students with so many different backgrounds. It gives them the opportunity to be who they are. And you know, whatever may be happening in a, in a kid's life, just to have that safe place to be and to just have a good time, I think is so important. If you're 12, 13, 14, like, you definitely don't know who you are yet. I don't care who you are, you don't. I think the bridge is a really good place to like figure out who you are. Like, I myself have seen like how much I've grown. I now have only been with my job for a couple of months, but they're already having me train new people because I was so confident from all the leadership positions that I was put in at the bridge. As I was doing the programs, I found a love for cooking more than I already had, and it kind of was able to push me into uh, the career of culinary arts. Honestly, it was the programs and the environment, and everybody was so friendly and always so willing to learn. Even to this day, like, I'll just have like a flash of like a memory, and I'll be like, oh my gosh, like that was a bridge program, like that was a really fun day. <laughs> from the culinary classes that I took to different arts classes. There is something for everybody. Also, changing the oil on the car, like I've never forgotten that. I still know how to do it to this day. My brother does not, my dad does not, but I'm like, I learned from the bridge how to change oil on the car. <laughs> and the fact that I could do these things that I was interested in for no cost was absolutely amazing. If they weren't free, I don't know if I would have been able to go to the programs. For a potential donor, I would say you're about to impact so many different lives and you're going to help the next generation to become what we want to see in the world. If you want the youth in your community to thrive, donate to the bridge. To donate to a place that is all for the kids and the teenagers that come here. I, I think that's really important. If you donate to the bridge, you help tons of students be able to figure out things that they want to do. It's going to go to a safe place for students. It's going to go to making sure that they have properly funded programs and that they have all the tools and skills that they need to succeed in life. If teens like need a place they can go to besides just school and like after school activities, that like they can learn and grow from because we don't really have that around here or anywhere. You can help set someone up for success in the future, whether it's going to college, going to a trade school. They're going to learn opportunities and learn skills here that they're going to use the rest of their lives. You may not step past the front door, but like physically, but your like heart will.